Hello, I am Osamu Yamaguchi. I am willing to present our Mirai study as the article of the man's. I would like to start with the background of this study. Antimascarinic agents are widely used for the treatment of overactive bladder. Recently, as a new class of therapeutic agent, Mirabegron, a selective beta-3 adrenoceptor agonist, has entered clinical practice. Therefore, combining Mirabegron with an antimascarinic agent may potentially improve efficiency in the treatment of overactive bladder. The main objective of the present study was to evaluate the safety profile of mirabegron as add-on therapy in patients with OAV are treated with solifenacin. In addition, we evaluated efficacy from baseline to the end of treatment. Uh, this was March Center Open Label Phase 4 study. Patients who had met eligibility criteria continued to receive solifenacin 2.5 or 5 mg once daily and additional mirabegron 25 mg once daily for 16 weeks. After 8 weeks of treatment, the mirabegron dose could be increased to 50 mg if the patient's symptom improvement was not sufficient. The results showed overall incidence of drug-related treatment emergent adverse events was 23.3%. Almost all adverse events were mild or moderate. The most common adverse events were concurrent with the known safety profile of minamegron and sulfenacin monotherapy. Constipation was the most common adverse event. No urinary retention was noted in this study, and no notable changes from baseline were seen for the mean post-void residual volume in any treatment group. The mean changes in the QTCF interval from baseline to the end of treatment was 4.3, 3.4, 2.0, and 2.2 milliseconds for each group respectively, showing no significant prolongation of the QTCF interval. Changes in blood pressure and pulse rate were not considered to be clinically significant. Significant improvements from baseline were seen uh, for the total overactive bladder symptom score in all treatment groups at week 8, 16, and at the end of treatment. The mean number of micturition per day decreased significantly from baseline in all treatment groups. Significant improvement from baseline were also seen for the overactive bladder symptom bladder score and the quality of life score in all treatment groups. In conclusion, add-on therapy was mirabegron 25 mg for 16 weeks with an optional dose increase to 50 mg at week 8 was well tolerated in OAB patients treated with solifenacin 2.5 mg or 5 mg once daily. There were significant improvements from baseline to the end of treatment in OAB symptoms with this combination therapy. Add one therapy with mirabegron and antimascarinic agent such as sulfenacin may provide an attractive therapeutic option. Thank you for your attention.